Hello, 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 hello. Hopefully this is uh, coming through okay. So if you can just leave a comment, that'd be great. Um, obviously you're not seeing much of my, well actually I might be able to do it that way. That might be better, upside down. <laughs> oh, this is all new. Rotate your device, you can't turn your phone while live. Oh, oh, pants. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, so I'm live guys. I'm here, um, we'll just wait for some people to go on. Um, I had to go for a call of duty, call of nature, call of duty, what am I talking about? No idea. So, uh, this is my, uh, ah, one person, hello, who's that? I can't even see. <laughs> ah, hiya. Hello, hello. Let me know if it's if it's all right okay so just give us a thumbs up or something like that uh if you can actually see this all right because i have got it sideways because i've had to put it on a on a selfie stick <laughs> and i can't do it around the other way i'm pretty certain i can't it won't stretch that far all right thanks thanks guys <laughs> oh so <clears throat> how does it work well, we'll just wait to see. We've got we've got four people up there so far, all right? Um, and then I'll explain how it works. And then all you've got to do is just comment, all right? Uh, if you know the answer to a clue, riddle, or uh, if you see something, you'll say where it is. So on the chair, on the table, that kind of thing, all right? Hopefully this works. If it does, and you get me out of here in perfect time, I'm hoping that I've given you enough time. Normally, uh, escape rooms are about 45 minutes. I'm only giving you 30 because this is my brain that's worked them out, okay? So hopefully we've got some really clever people on board. <laughs> I hope. Right, let's just bring that down a bit more. Oh, that's, that's better. My arms are so aching. <laughs> and I'm also looking at the wrong side of the screen. Yes, I am. Right. <laughs> The camera's over there. <laughs> 13 people on board. Excellent. Okay, so um, I've just checked the time down there. Okay, because I've got the timer. The timer's down here, right down there. Um, and the time is five past. All right, we've got 11 people on board. So let's go with it then, shall we? Right, uh, so uh, I'm in. Uh, my panic room, okay? Basically, my aunt is a bit, um... Uh, if you can hear me, just give me another thumbs up, just in case. Anybody, just give us a thumbs up. If you can hear me, hopefully you can. Super, thank you. Right, okay, so, uh, my aunt has closed the door. She's very, uh, absent-minded, okay? And, uh... She's locked it from the other side. Um, it's it's a special it's a special key that locks this door, um, and I need you guys to help me out in the next thirty minutes because otherwise I won't be able to go for a wee, um, get some food or anything. I'll be stuck in here, four walls. I'd rather see the whole house, please. Okay. Uh, how you do that is, uh, I've got rhymes, clues, riddles, or shall I say, she has uh, hidden in this room. Okay, so I'm going to show you the room. First of all, I've hidden all pictures that are, are real because obviously I didn't want you to see that. All right, so hopefully I can show you this. All right, so we've got we've got the uh, got a bit there. I'm sorry it's sideways, but I couldn't really do a lot about that. <laughs> right, we've got a telly, we've got a unit over here, we've got some bits on the floor and stuff. All right, so. There you go, that's the room, okay? Uh, <clears throat> okay, now when, I, when we begin, I'll start the timer that's down there. Okay, the timer's down there. So I'll start that, and then we've got 30 minutes to help me out of here. All you've got to do is comment um, on what I'm asking. That's it. As soon as I see the answer float up, then obviously uh, we'll go with that one and we'll move on, all right? Uh, hopefully it's a bit of fun. So uh, let's, let's start, shall we? Okay, let's go for it. Right, so the timer is down here, uh, and our time has begun. It's one second in, all right, one second in. Okay, uh, now apparently 
there's a bucket in here and it's got it's got a where is it where is it oh no uh okay <laughs> oh oh no what's going on <laughs> That's it. That's it. I grabbed the wrong one. Oh, I knew she'd leave me a clue somewhere because the key is in here somewhere. Right. Okay. It says, um, oh, hello. Not that way. <laughs> you are still the rubbish. Right. Uh, welcome all to some fun. Throw some bugs. The panic room has begun. Right. So there we go. We throw that out the way and I've got the questions. So I'm going to say some questions. Down here are some bugs. There's some bugs just here. Okay. Obviously, the answers are what what uh, the answers are right in front of you. All right. So just see them bugs again. Right. Okay. You got a black and white one, a yellow one, and a red one. Remember that. All right. Here we go. Uh, number one. In 1900, the color of what fever was discovered? Just comment. Comment down. But uh, just send it. Uh, whatever colour you think it is, just go for it. Guess. Guess away. All right. What, uh, so in 1900, the colour of what fever was discovered? Sorry if this is blurring out. I'm shaking. <laughs> so any comments? Any comment? Yes, John. Well done. Yellow. Yellow. It is yellow. OK, it's a yellow fever. So I'm just going to chuck the bug in the bucket. Yes, I've done it. <laughs> Hopefully you saw that. Right, the next question. What is the main colour? Uh, sorry, what is the main colour of the Chinese flag? What is the main colour of the Chinese flag? No, it's not yellow, it's not black. Main colour of the Chinese flag? I've showed you. Any ideas? Oh, oh, nearly, Kath, nearly. Not, not red and yellow. Not red and yellow. Red, Naomi, well done, it's red. Yes, we're gonna chuck the red bug. Here's the red bug. Right there it is, the red bug. I'll chuck it into the bucket. This is so hard we can't see what you're doing. Right, okay. Uh, last one, I think it's quite obvious. A magpie's feathers are what two colors? A magpie's feathers are what two colors? A magpie's feathers are t what two colors? Scarlet, no. <laughs> red, no. We're probably on the next one. Oh, Naomi, we need another colour. We got black. Come on. What was about? John, well done. Black and white. Yes. And Catherine as well. Well done. And lots of you getting it now. Sean, well done. Lauren, well done. OK, I've got it. Right. Anyway, we've got to move on. Right. So chuck that in the bucket. Here we go. Oh, shucks. <laughs> right. The clue. The clue should be in the bucket. So let's have a look. Let's have a look. Uh, see if it's right. Ah, uh, uh, I can see a clue in there. Okay, three minutes gone. Three minutes gone. Uh, right, it's a. Uh, it's it's more like a crossword, really. It says a cooking herb, and you've got four missing letters. A cooking herb. I don't know if this is coming back to front, but this is what this says. All right. Obviously, I've got the mirror version. Right, a cooking herb. What kind of herb would you cook with? Any ideas? Because, uh, oh, actually, just to give you a clue, uh, let's see, let's see if uh, I'll swap it around. Right, hang on, swap it around. Right, a cooking herb. If I'm gonna look around, see if you can see anything that resents a thing, a Ming, Naomi, what's a Ming? Oh, Naomi, well done, it's a mint. Yes, a mint, a mint, a mint. Well done, well done. Right, okay, uh, we're opening up the mint. If I can even open this one-handed. Right, okay. Yes, I've got it. I've got it. Okay. It says, oh, it's an anagram. It's an anagram. Here it goes. Uh, cook a chop another way. Cook a chop another way. That's an anagram. Any ideas? Cook a chop another way. <laughs> well done, Naomi. You got it. Right, but the obvious, the uh, the other one, not this one. Cook a chop another way. Any ideas? I might have a mint. I need a mint. My God. Uh, we'll just see if anybody gets it. Any ideas? Cook a chop another way. Yes, you best not be Googling this, you lot, right? No cheating, right? Okay, done it. Yes, um, poach. Poach, and uh, you would poach. What? Hang on. What would you poach? Um... You'd poach. Um, and it, what would you poach, guys? 
Uh, any ideas? What would you poach? Um, let's let's have a look. Hang on. Sixteen people on now. Right. Okay. Um, and looking around for any items that you would poach. Remember, not just what you would poach, but how you would poach it. Right. Yes, John. It's an an egg is correct, but how would you how would you uh, how would you poach an egg? Uh, what does it have to uh, what does it have to reach? You know, like um, you have to watch it, watch it something. What would you poach? It's poaching an egg, but uh, do you need a clue? Right, I'll give you a hint. Uh, something that um, begins with T. T. You got to test something in order to find out if the egg is actually boiled. And you would check it's a bit like if you have a fever. <laughs> I'm trying to make this as easy as possible. <laughs> uh, steam, simmer, no, no. We're on six minutes now, six minutes. Right, um, no, you wouldn't do that. Uh, temperature, well done. Naomi, you're good at this. John's got temperature. Jeff's got temperature. Well done. Temperature, temperature, temperature is correct. And that must mean a thermometer. Okay, so let's open, let's move the thermometer. I'm going to help you there, right? Thermometer. Ah, we've got this. Okay, this is a question or a clue. Keeps going and going and going. What's the answer? Keeps going and going and going. Any ideas? Right. Uh, I'll look around to see if uh, actually no. Give me the answer, and then we can have a look around. Right. So keeps going and going and going. Any ideas? Alarm? No, not an alarm. Think old school. Uh, keeps going and going and going. Uh, uh, <laughs> cheers, Jeff. Um, a clock? No, clock's up there. That that was a good guess, but it's not the clock, right? Um, going, going, going. Don't worry about what's in the room. Just what do you think gets going and going and going? Uh, uh, your clue is energy. Something with energy. Powers lots of stuff. I'll look around so you can see. But I don't think the item is actually in here. All right. Uh, the, the item is here. It's inside. And a Duracell bunny is close. Is close. What is a Duracell bunny? What's Duracell? What is Duracell? <laughs> a battery. Calf, you got... Duracell battery, batteries is good, right? It's actually energizer, right? It is actually energizer is the answer, but battery is what we want. So what in the room, what in the room has got a battery in it? What in the room has got a battery in it? Any ideas? There might be a clue right in front of you. I might have gone past it, I might not. Any ideas? What has a battery in it? Eight minutes gone. A torch. Well done. I saw that. I saw Sean. Well done. You got the torch. So, yeah, it must be the torch. Long cross as well. And uh, inside is batteries. We've got the batteries. Yes, we've got the batteries. Well done, guys. Right. A hammer featured in the small etching. This is a, a hidden. There's a hidden clue in this. There's a hidden clue in it. All right. So, a hammer featured in the small etching. The actual clue answer is in that sentence in front of you. All right, so the clue is hidden in there. What do you think it is? It's an anagram. If you're cheating, you're only cheating yourself, right? But if obviously it takes too long, then obviously cheat. <laughs> I didn't say that, right? A mallet, Catherine Louise. Right. If anybody got before, well done. But Catherine and Louise is well done. Yes, it is a mallet. All right. A mallet. So we'll just stick that back in there. A mallet. Anybody can see a mallet or something close to a mallet. Just say what the item is and I'll go for it. Any ideas? What should I go for? Any ideas? What? It's not a mallet, obviously. What else is like a mallet? That's in the room. 
Anything like a mallet? A hammer. Well done, Sean. Yes, it's the hammer. We'll go for the hammer. Grab the hammer. What's on it? We've got piece of news that's back in prime time. Right? Well done if you got that answer. All right. So uh, a piece of news that's back in prime time is a reversed clue. This is a reverse clue. The clue is actually in this, but it's reversed. So the answer's there, but it's in reverse. All right. Newspaper. No, it's not newspaper. I'll try and hold it steady for you guys. Sorry about that. Piece of news that's back in prime time. Newspaper. No, newspaper. No, no. I've done hammer already, guys. We've got the hammer, right? <clears throat> this is now this clue. Piece of news that's back in prime time. Probably one of the hardest ones. It's a reverse clue. So the answer's there, but it's just in reverse. So you've got to take the letters and piece together something else. You're probably going to need to look this up, to be fair. <laughs> well done if you just watched up to this time, right? We lost two people, but hey, you know. That's the idea. It's just a bit of fun. Take your uh, mind off everything that's going on at the minute. All right. OK, so a piece of news that's back in prime time. If you've just joined us, uh, you need to figure out where what the answer is in this. OK, new space. No. Um, the clue is hidden in this. OK. Uh, <laughs> it's it's usually to help you. It's usually the first word of the sentence or that's part of it okay we might have to skip this if you can't get me out in time guys right printer no not printer piece of news that's back in prime time any ideas man it's so hot in here right <laughs> i'm burning up <laughs> Woo! okay news at 10 no peace ah no peace yes um, uh, I need to elaborate on that. Um, <laughs> um, if you've got lots of stuff, what do you usually call it? Something in pieces. Something in pieces. I'm sort of giving it you really, right? Something in pieces. I feel as I've probably spelled that completely wrong. Right. Name has got peace right but it's it's i need to elaborate on a bit more okay i'll tell you what we'll just we should just go for it should we we'll go with naomi pieces bits and pieces that's what i needed bits and pieces right ah well done jeff you got it straight away <laughs> both of you come in just as i said it so well done on that one right <laughs> bits and pieces so um we need to look around the room to find uh bits and pieces bits and pieces so uh just say what you think the item I should go for, okay? Uh, 13 minutes gone. 13 minutes gone. I'm going to move around the room and just make sure you can see everything. I'm sorry it's a bit dark. It's just to make it a little bit more atmospheric. All right. What do you think I should look under? Bits and pieces is the clue. It looks like it should be this area, really. Uh, peacetime puzzle, no jigsaw. Moving on, guys. Got to look at the item. What's the item I've got to look under? Any ideas? Any ideas of what I should look under? Over? Um, something like that? No, no, it's not in there. Any suggestions? Sewing box? Yes. Uh, I was thinking that, right. Sewing box. Ah, okay, yeah, got one. Some Hastings wine. Okay, some Hastings wine. So uh, you've got to find the answer is actually hidden somewhere in here. OK, somewhere in this this sentence. Right. Some Hastings wine. Any ideas? Some Hastings wine. Hmm. Uh, <laughs> if you've just joined us, uh, it's the panic room. Basically, you're just finding out clues, riddles and more. Uh, you've just got to figure out what is actually hidden in this sentence. All right. If you're just watching now. Uh, you just got to figure out what the answer is. It's actually hidden right in front of you. Some Hastings wine. If you know the answer, just comment on it and uh, we can go straight to the next clue and find it. All right. Sweets. No, it's not sweets. It's actually right there. Oh, I see what you're doing. No, it, the actual word is all together in the sentence. It's all together in the sentence. So some Hastings wine. 
You can see two bottles of wine behind me. That might be a bit of a clue, although that's the only one I could actually find. So, uh, any clues? <laughs> Let's just, oh, hello. I put a flash on there for some reason. There we are. Okay, so uh, some Hastings wine is what this says, right? Um, the actual word is hidden in this clue, all right? It's actually hidden in there and it's all together, all right? If you just comment on what wine that is, what kind of wine, usually some people have it at weddings, uh, if you don't like champagne, and uh, some people have uh, it at um, uh, special New Year's. Everybody has it on New Year's. I would say it flies out, it does. Sting, <laughs> what do you mean sting? Oh, I see what you're doing. No, no, it's not. You were so close as well. You're so close. You're one letter off. Start a little bit before Sting and you'll get it. Before Sting. What is it? Come on. Flash, well done. Asti. Yes, it is. It's Asti. Look, it's right in the middle. Asti. Well done. Right. Okay. Uh, so the, uh, the, uh, uh, which one? Well, it's one of these, right? So, uh, unfortunately I couldn't get Asti, so we had to have Rosé. <laughs> ah, clue. Got it. Okay, uh, this one I'm gonna have to read to you because it's too hard to show on there, all right? There are, there are two ducks in front of a duck, two ducks behind a duck, and a duck in the middle. How many ducks are there in total? All right, so how many ducks are there in total? I'll say that again. There are two ducks in front of a duck, two ducks behind a duck, and a duck in the middle, how many ducks are there in total? So how many ducks do you think? <laughs> we might have to do that again. Five, Jeff, unfortunately not, no. Keep going, guys. Just, I tell you what, just randomly guess. Ah, Sean, well done. You just come straight in there with three. The answer is three. Well done. The answer is three and 17 minutes gone, right? There's only 30 minutes in total. Can we do this? Right. Uh, oh crap, <laughs> three. So you've got to look around to see um, what has got a number three on it. What's got a number three? And uh, tell me, just tell me in comments what you should think I should look at, all right? So what do you think I should look at? All right, it's got a number three on it. And number three, what do you think I should look at? A lock, no, no. I can't even see a lock. What are you talking about? <laughs> oh, a clock. Right, a clock. A clock. Let's grab that. No, there's nothing under the clock. There's nothing under the clock. Um, anything else? Anything else? Anything else? Notches on your headboard. Cheers, <laughs> Flash. <laughs> phone. Yes, all right, phone. Let's go for the phone. There's a number three on it. Well done. Okay, let's open the... Fro ah, ah. To complete the puzzle, you will find the pieces to help you to remind. So complete the puzzle, you will find the pieces to help you to remind. Okay, uh, obviously there is a, there's a puzzle down there. So um, I need you to, uh, we've got to do this pretty fast, only 18 minutes, all right? So uh, I need you to uh, look around, tell me where a jigsaw piece is and then just send me there and I'll put it into the puzzle, all right? So here goes, right? Jigsaw pieces. Just say where you think the jigsaw piece is and I'll, I'll, uh, I'll go there. Calendar, no, no. Just say where an item of uh, jigsaw is. Just tell me where a piece of jigsaw is. If you just joined us, all we are doing is telling me where jigsaw pieces are. And don't say the floor. Right, the chair. The chair. Which chair? Which chair? That chair? That one? The chair. All right. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Oh, behind Teddy. Behind Teddy? Oh, yeah, all right. We'll grab him. Ah, yes, you've got one. Well done. I'll put that in there. That's it. Uh, left. Oh, we've got the left one. Both, both chairs, okay? Both chairs. Yeah, there's another one. I've got another one. Oh, you have to pick the hardest pieces. <laughs> I don't 
don't even know where this bloody piece goes. Oh, okay, right. I think that's it. Let's get that in there. Right, uh, sorry, keep going. Behind the TV, behind the TV. All right, behind the TV, yes, got that one as well. Well done. Uh, got that one. Stick that in there. I've, oh man, I've just done that wrong. <laughs> right, okay, so we've got some of it. We need another piece. There's another piece somewhere. Uh, magazine rack, okay. Good job I just saw that because I might have missed it then. Right, magazine rack, I've got that. Right, gotta put it in. Hopefully this will tell us everything we need to know. Oh my word, what is going on? Oh, it's, I can't even do jigsaw puzzles. I haven't been, I've, how'd you do a jigsaw puzzle? <laughs> I can't do the jigsaw puzzle. <laughs> oh my God, quick, go, 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 go. Right, okay. Ah, right, okay, so here we go. I may have four legs. Oh my God, it's 21 minutes. Right, I may have four legs, but never walk. It's a riddle. I may be covered in flowers, but have no soil. I hold food three times a day, but never eat a meal. What am I? What am I? Can you solve the riddle? I have four legs, but never walk. I may be covered in flowers, but have no soil. Chair? No, not a chair. She's pretty certain it's not the chair. Let's have a chair. It's a chair. No. Oh my God. Sorry, Nan. I mean, aunt. Whoops. <laughs> uh table flash yes table let's have a look table no there's nothing under the tables go i'm gonna hurry up i don't want to get stuck in here uh okay i'm gonna swap it around hang on a table um uh bed there's no bed in here john uh table it it sounds like table um maybe we should just look at the pictures around the room i'll swap it around see if uh where's i'm not in the kitchen right See if you can see a uh, anything that's got a table in it. Anything. Anything that's got a table. There's obviously these tables. I've checked these tables already. Right. A table. Just tell me where to go. Okay, bowl. No, no, it's a table. It's definitely a table. It's got to be. But we, need, we either need a picture with a table in it or an actual table. All right. So uh, send me there, guys. Send me there. Uh, we've got 22 minutes. I've got to get out of here at, like, in 30 minutes. All right? Come on, guys. Help me out. Come on. All right. Look. <laughs> What's that say? <laughs> Stop. Picture next to curtain. Picture next to curtain? What picture next to curtain? Oh, that one. No, there's no, there's no table in it. There's no... There's no table. Come on, guys. Oval black picture. Oval black picture. Oh, which one, though? Which one? Which one? Too late picture on the wall. Uh, too, too late? What are you talking about? Picture on the wall. Picture. Yeah, oval picture. It is the oval picture. All right, we'll just look behind both of them. Right. Uh, no, no, it's not there. How about this one? How about this one? We'll have a look at this one. Aha! <laughs> Well done, well done, I think I found the key. I've got the key, guys, I've got the key. I know, it's like a hotel in here. Right, okay, let's see. <laughs> I'm out, I'm out, yes! Well done, thank you so much for letting me out of the uh, panic room today. So much for all of you to join again. I'm impressed that there's that many people, to be honest. I'm sorry about the low lighting in here, it's a bit rubbish, isn't it? Uh, if you, uh, because you got me out within the 30 minutes, look, 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 look. 24. Yes. 24 minutes. Look at that. 24 minutes you did it in. Right. If you think you can beat that, then uh, I don't know if I need a day of recovery, really. But um, I might do one. And in fact, because I have to plan it a day, I will do it not today. What the hell day is it today? Is it Wednesday today? Right. <laughs> Hopefully you like that. All right, it's just a bit of fun. There's anagrams, there's other stuff in there. I'll do another one in a different part of the house. This, my aunt's house is pretty, fairly big, all right? And uh, if you like that, leave, please leave a comment underneath the Facebook, on my Facebook page, just saying, you know, about it. Uh, any suggestions on other clues, other things that could be added into it, all right? And uh, join me on, is it Friday? Uh, what day is it? Any idea what day is it? 
<laughs> Where's my aunt's house? Uh, I'm in Ellsbury. <laughs> Ellsbury and Buckinghamshire, right? Um, so, uh, so a day, not tomorrow, but the next day, right? Uh, please leave a comment uh, when you can tell me what day that Thursday. So that's Thursday. What day is it today? I'm sure it's Wednesday today, isn't it? Oh no, it's Thursday today. So we'll do the next one Saturday. Okay, so Saturday I'll be uploading a video tomorrow on Facebook uh, about my next day in isolation um, for more madcap craziness. Um, but the next uh, one of these, the uh, panic room, is on <laughs> Saturday. Saturday, I don't know what I'm doing, I swear. I've been in too long. I need a drink. I'll see you later. Uh, that should do. Woohoo! Oh, and if you haven't seen it already, uh, join Flash on his Lego house, okay? Um, I'm sure he's going to be uploading more as well. They are fantastic. They really are. <laughs> uh, also, uh, there'll be impressions on the way too. Thanks, guys. I'll see you later. Bye. Yes! I'm out! <laughs>